welcome to Subscriber News Spring in France. I'm Budsy. And I'm Mr. Bloke. And tonight's top story is we've moved into the workshop. Remember this? It's day one on the property. We've come a long way since then. In other major news, uh, we are in the process of applying for an auto entrepreneur visa. We moved to France knowing that we had about a year that we could live off our savings and buy the property and begin a renovation, but we aren't retired and we actually do need to work. Mm -hmm. So we are hoping Blo can reopen his Etsy shop yep. and I can open up healing arts business here in France. So we just sent out our paperwork and we are waiting. I don't like to do fingers crossed because um, it seems like it never works when I do. So think we go like this, fingers uncrossed. <laughs> yeah, fingers uncrossed. Best case scenario is we're granted one year auto entrepreneur so we can prove to the French government that we can make a viable income and we can stay in France. Worst case scenario is we have to accept the fact that we may have to go back to the United States. Just, uh, we are at the mercy of the French government right now. We'll, we'll see. We'll, you know, if we've got to go back to the States, we have to go back to the States. So stay tuned, and as we hear anything, we will update you in our weekly videos. But um, we just wanted to put that out there that um, we have two, two scenarios happening right now, and we're just waiting to see um, what happens. And now we have a special report where Budsy is outstanding in her field. I'm standing here in field number two. We have three fields here at Tracerie's farm. We've named, we've come up with a name for field number two. Field number two includes spiritual corners, our garden, and this beautiful hay. And field number two is now going to be known as Taurus Field. Speeding tickets. <laughs> This is all you. Actually, it's me now, too. I got one, another one. So that is... I was so careful. I, was, I'm, I watch, I watch all the time. I'm like so careful driving. I'm looking at the thing. That was a... The night of the kebabs. We just got this awesome to-go food. <laughs> so that's four. And then I got one. Cruising along, going what two kilometers over the mm. allotted 87. If you do, you're allowed 85, I guess, in an 80, yeah. like five kilometers over, which in America is what is a two joke. or three miles. They wouldn't over. even, they wouldn't bat an eye at that. The so pitch, you just yeah. get driving and you're thinking, and then all of a sudden you go from this to no, <laughs> yeah, and then flash. And you, they find you. They, they take find the money. you. So they they got me one. So it's four bloke, one budsy. But regarding speeding tickets, we have some great news. Remember back in subscriber news, yeah, we, November or whatever the first one we did in France. Yeah, we showed you this one. Guess well, what? <laughs> look at look at it now. Remember this from the first subscriber news. Viva la resistance! I don't know if you should be. I don't know if you're allowed to. Yeah, I think it's. it's I was glad to see it. Good, good on the French people. These things get you. Re it's too yeah, low. Yeah, I know they, they're doing they it in England to, too, and yeah. they're, like, they're like tearing them down too. Yeah, so it's like, good. It's, it's good. shocking. Like they just yeah. rob you, rob the people. Yeah. What happened to face your accuser, right? Yeah. <laughs> we have a. An announcement from Mr. Bloke about changes in our Buy Me A Coffee. We would like to put the names of the people that buy us a coffee on this OSB wall because we think once it's finished, it's going to be a, just a beautiful work of art. So grateful. Thank you so much for everyone that has bought us a coffee. It has helped us so much um, yeah. with supplies and we were gonna use it for a wood burning stove, but we got a great lead on a wood burning stove. So we were able to actually get some electric heaters for in here. So thank you so much. Okay, our next section is France versus the US. Okay, careful with your <laughs> US one now. Okay, <laughs> first, first topic, to-go containers and asking for a to-go container. Ah, yes. yes. USA. USA. The 
restaurants in France when you go to ask for a to-go because, for example, if we we rarely go out to eat, but if we do and we get too much, we yeah. like to take it home and then eat it. Yeah, we don't want to waste any food. We love we love food and we don't <laughs> so want to waste it and throw it away. They but. really, it is a weird thing in France to ask for a good to-go. To, yeah. They kind of look at you like uh, it's... I don't know the culture or the protocol on that. And actually, this is a question we should ask Olivier, but um, we have done it twice. And both times it's been very, um, like, like, frowned upon. Yeah. In the USA, they'll send you everything in a toko container, yeah. even the last little bit of salsa if you if you want it. So yeah. um, we just, we give USA to-go yes. containers at restaurants. Yes, USA to-go. Fire extinguishers. Oh, USA too, yeah. Again, the USA. So, we, of course, to be safe, we wanted a smoke alarm and a fire extinguisher. And I went to buy one, and no, 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 you have to go to the fire department. And our previous hosts had um, told us that, yeah, and it's like 137 euros plus yeah. tax. You have to go to the fire department for fire safety. I couldn't believe it. You can buy a fire extinguisher anywhere all day long in the USA. So, France, get it together with the fire extinguishers. We did luck out and find one at the Brooklyn yeah, Marche. The small, they do sell smaller ones. Little small one. Yeah. But that was enough to kind of appease me for, you know, quick yeah. emergency safety. So, um, I don't know why it's that way in France. Yeah. They They're should just... be readily available to everyone on the planet. Uh, but anyway, USA, your fire safety is Top notch. That's two zero to the USA. I know. Okay, What's so let's got? do one more France. Okay. <laughs> wine, wine, France, uh, wine. Oh, easy. Did we, did we? didn't never do wine before. Never done wine before. Hands down. Oh France. my god. Yeah. And I want to tell you, I, we're not big drinkers, um, but you can get an excellent bottle of wine for yeah. five euros here in France. And they sell it at the hardware stores, which I just think is great. Yeah. <laughs> you can get it anywhere. Yeah. Grocery store. They do have special wine stores. Um, and yeah. I'm sure I'm sure if we um, indulged in some higher-end wines, we'd be blown yeah. away. We're not wine aficionados, but, you know, like a buying a five... Euro uh, bottle of it's wine. Like it's like a twenty dollar bottle. Twenty twenty five dollar in the US Easy. for the kind of quality Delicious, you get. Delicious, so, good yeah, wine really, really and good. tons of it. And apparently, um, and we need to look more into this. They have, um, in, I think it was Bordeaux. They have too much wine, so they're actually cutting down the grape vines yeah. because of too much wine growing. So I, I don't know. That was a that's, that's a. Crazy. Um, I think Olivier told us that bags of spinach. I know this is a weird one, but mm. hear me out. Yes. USA, hands down, wins bags of spinach. Yes. You could take a bag of spinach off the grocery store, put a bunch of dressing in there and eat it, no problem. They wash your spinach, and some of them, like, organic girl, advertise, wash three times or whatever. No problem. We, I, say, bought the spinach, and I served it in a salad the first time, and we're eating it. And we're crunching and sandy, dirty, <laughs> gritty, filthy. sandy spinach in our yeah, mouths, yeah. and I was like, so, "Oh, that's weird." So then I tried again, and this time I did. I bought another bag, and we um, sautéed it. Same thing, greedy, nasty. So you I should have learned from that. <laughs> just give this. Scrub I finally three realized. Times wash. Right, you need to wash your spinach in France. So yeah. it even if it comes in a bag. Um, it has not been washed and it needs to get washed. So, mm -hmm. um, the convenience of already having your spinach pre-washed in the USA is very, very nice. But, first, you know, first whatever. First world problems. Yeah. <laughs> first world problems, yeah. Go USA for your clean spinach. <laughs> USA. USA. Okay. And finally, the last item for France versus US is the uh, thrift store, mm -hmm. also known as the Emails. 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 We're trying to get our French down, but France. Absolutely what they should be for a thrift store, yeah. secondhand stuff. You can go yeah. into the US and at Goodwill or some Salvation, and it's expensive. Here, 
it's very reasonably priced and they're they will negotiate with you yeah if you well, offer a lower price and and they meet in the middle and they didn't um, even meet in the middle the last photo he last just, like, time he didn't he, uh, he wanted 35 for a bunch of wood that i got and i said i'll give you 25 and he's like okay yeah it was great. great so um i will say i think they're more fair priced um they, you know, they're a bit, they're like thrift stores, you know, there's stuff strewn about it all over the place, yeah. but we've, we've scored some really great things at the, th some more there's windows, some great stuff. Yeah. cups, yeah. wine glasses, drinking glasses, plates, things oh, like yeah. that. Yeah. So Great stuff. Like, and and they and they change. Yeah. So much stuff all going the time. through there. All, and so many people going through there and buying. And that's why they move it. They, cause they get so much, you know, you have a lot of people coming in, everyone's leaving with stuff. It's yeah. like you don't, that, that's the sit. way to do it. You just move it. Yeah. You sell move it cheap it. and you move it. So we want to um, finish this episode of Subscriber News by saying thank you. First, let's start with Tracy and Budo at French Farmhouse Diaries. We are so grateful to have met these guys. They make us laugh. They make us think. We have a great time. Every time we go over there, we say, well, you know, we'll just stay for an hour or two, and it's six hours later because we're all just chatting away. Right. We're just going to go for a cup of tea and uh, chat for a couple of hours. But and, it's yeah. fun, and we love their company, yeah. and they have a great channel at French Farmhouse Diaries. They are so close to 10,000 subscribers, yeah, so we're hoping this can push 10, them over because um, um, it's, really, it's a good milestone when you hit 10,000. Yeah on YouTube and um, so yeah we we want to show you a few of the things they've gifted us which we've been so grateful for yeah. the willow and the well, we're just um, gonna show them, right? special chips <laughs> the special yeah. chips <laughs> yeah yeah we got some pre-recorded footage yeah right here so the raspberries are good to go these were a gift from Budo and Tracy and so were these. This is, is it a uh, golden, golden willow? Yeah, I think golden willow. And they're starting, and to, look. starting to sprout. Yeah, they're all. They told us to wait for, the, yeah, yeah the roots, and the roots are here. So. And then what's the last thing you have in your bucket here? Raspberries. Yep, there's one more thing. Oh, this, fig. Fig nation. But no, no sprouts on the fig, but top, top, top. Yeah. Okay, fig, yeah. So we're gonna use the um, willow in the garden as a windscreen, which is exactly what they use it for. And the raspberries, of course, um, we'll put in the garden too to eat. <laughs> yeah. Okay, let's go see what else Tracy and Buddha got us. Okay, okay. <laughs> this is a hot mess. This is what this we're is, sorting through. <laughs> we got another. We got two more. We got another room just like this that needs sorting as well. So uh, over the next few weeks, month, we're gonna empty all these boxes, get everything organized, tools, because we're always looking for stuff. It's like we just can't find anything because it's all a mess. Okay, so this is the uh, the uh, shavings that from Budo and Tracy. I think we've got five or six bags. Yeah. And they said they have another one for us too. Oh, it smells so good. It's um, sweet chestnut. So we're using it for our compost toilet. And they is from, they made the sweet chestnut for their kitchen. Yeah. So this is their cutoff from his hard work cutting those from yeah, scratch he planks. Does, he does on an <laughs> Alaskan sawmill. So he's like pushing a chainsaw. Unbelievable. Himself. Yeah. It's amazing to watch. You know, see him do it. Yeah, go check him out. Check it out. And um, they're almost at ten thousand subs, those guys. So we want to push them over. Yeah, Come on, guys! Over so 10, close. Subs. That would be awesome because it's quite a landmark to hit ten thousand. It really subs. is. And we we got hemp hemp chips over here too. So we mix the two together. And we got and these at the Bioku. Yeah. Bio Bio. They bio, say it Bio Bio Bioku. Bio bio here in we France. We were at Biocoop. Yeah, we caught the Biocoop, but it's but the Biocoop. Bio but Ping, who told us about the Biocoop? Ping. And then we have Ping. Ping. Who, uh, thank you, Ping, sent thank us you. a beautiful package for, and it was just before we moved in here. So it was like a moving in gift, like a care package, uh, 
housewarming. It, yeah, and it was beautiful. I cried. I was so excited. So yeah. let, let's show you um, some yeah. of those items now too. So this one is from Ping. This is a uh, lilac. We don't know what color. He said maybe white or pink. Did he say? Um, purple or pink? I purple. think. I can't, I can't remember. And um, then. And then this one is bay laurel. So a bay leaf. Um, yeah. We'll plant that. It's to be a big tree, but we're not sure we're going to put, put that or that just yet. So. Took us a while to get it potted, but we got them in these two pots at the store and we're able to get that potted. So thank you, Ping. Yeah. And we just started a little garden. We're a little afraid to do too much because of our uh, visa status. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we're waiting. Let's go. Um, there's other surprises Ping sent. Yeah. And um, let's go visit the cactus I like to call Aura for a reason. Ping packed this little, there's a cute little prickly thing. That's what he called it, a cute little prickly thing in the shavings of a wood project that we can't wait to show you. Thank you for opening your heart. Um, Ping is a viewer that has been from the very beginning when Bloke first did the video Man Box. I love these. And Ping is a woodworker. We had no idea. And if you look at all the little details here, and what are these things called? Inlays? I think inlays. And um, it's a step stool we keep in the kitchen and we love it and we use it um, all the time. Yeah, it's beautiful. And yeah. he, says, he says it's from pallet wood. He finds pallet wood. He lives in, in the city, I guess, in Paris. And um, yeah, it's beautiful. A huge thank you to my parents, Carol and Jed, for buying us some kitchen appliances. Awesome, thank you. We want to give a big thank you to Judy and Graham also for gifting us this beautiful hutch that is working great in the new workshop slash living space. So thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for subscribing. Um, you know, we, we love doing the YouTube. We're going to keep the videos coming. We don't know what's going to happen with the visa. We'll let you know as soon as we know. And um, we just really, really appreciate your support. And I hope you really enjoy our videos. We, we have fun making them. Yeah, we do. <laughs> editing is a different story. <laughs> yes, editing is a lot of work. It's a lot goes into the editing process. It's a full full time job. It's a full time really job, is. yeah. Yeah. So anyway, thanks for watching so much and um we will see you for subscriber news in the summer, summer edition. Yeah. Hopefully we're here in France. <laughs> um we'll have another video out on Sunday. And Sunday stay tuned. With, uh, what we've been up to this week. This week. Yeah. See you Sunday. Ta -ta. See you Sunday. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching.